Are you living for the weekend? Honestly, answer that question. Do you feel like day in, day out, every single week that you are just living to get to the weekend? Are you more excited about Friday than you are about Monday? I hear this phrase all the time. I'm just, I can't wait till Friday gets here. I'm just living for the weekend. If you live your life just wanting to get to the weekend, then you are wasting 72% of your waking days, your life on this planet, 72% of it is wasted Monday through Friday if you're just working to get to the weekends. If all that you're excited about, the only time when you're really truly happy is during the weekend, then you are wasting 72% of your life. What about right now? What about this very second? I'm recording this on a Tuesday, right? Let's say that, that I'm just a, a person who just hates working during the week. Well then, what about now? Why am I waiting for Friday and Saturday and Sunday? What about this very second? What are you doing right now? What do you love to do? What do you absolutely love to do? And what can you do right now to get more of that in your life? Answer that question real quick. Think about it. What do you absolutely love to do? And what can you do to get more of it in your life? Whether that's spending time with your kids, spending time with your significant other, traveling, skiing, surfing, going on road trips, all of these different things. What do you love to do and what can you do to set yourself up to have more of it in your life? Think about that for a second. You owe it to yourself to figure out a way to get more of what you love into your weekdays. Do you hate your job? Quit it. Do something that you love. Do you want to start your own company? Well, if you have a job right now, why don't you work on the, at night and on the weekends to build it and build something so that you can eventually replace your income at the job that you hate so you can wake up every single day and love what you do. I used to work for a company. Now I work for myself. I love every single day. I am excited. And this is not some BS. I'm excited for Mondays. I'm excited about it because I get to go back and actually start working and doing what I'm passionate about. That's what I hope for you. I hope that you can get to that point. What makes you feel alive? What do you love to do? What makes you feel alive? And then consider this. What if you could do that for the rest of your life? Isn't that what it's about? Isn't that the reason why we're here? So that you can love and appreciate everything that you do? Monday through Friday, work days, 40 hour work days, those are arbitrary numbers and arbitrary days made up by people just years ago in the same society that you're growing up in. How can you find a way right now to start working towards doing what you want to do day in and day out? I made a, uh, in, in 2005, the beginning of 2005 in January, I put my goal was to start making income at my own company so that I could leave the job that I was at. 11 months later, I left the job that I was at and I was doing what I wanted to do and I was creating my own income. And the reason why I wanted to create my own company was because I personally wanted to do something I was passionate about and that I could help people while doing and that I could travel while doing it as well. I'm excited to tell you something real quick. I'm gonna be moving to Rome with my girlfriend for six months because that is what I wanted to do. We're leaving in June to go to Rome for six months and then travel around the rest of Europe. I don't say that to brag, I say that because I'm nobody special. I'm just somebody who decided what they want, what they're passionate about, what they love to do, and figured out how to get more of it in their life. In 2012, I quit my job and went to Europe for three months and backpacked, and I fell in love with it, and I said I wanted to move here. And now it's coming to fruition. What can you do to do the same? Because I'm nobody special. You have the exact same opportunity in front of you. You have the exact same 24 hours that I do and every single other person does. What do you love to do? What are you passionate about? What makes you light up? What makes you feel alive? And what can you do to get more of it in your life? That's a question you should ask yourself and it may be one of the most important questions you ask yourself because it could be the difference between you hating 72% of your life and going and working for somebody else and doing things you don't want to do, hating 72% of your life or loving 100% of it.
Think about that and try to make a plan to start getting more of what you love to do in your day-to-day life. If you like this episode, please click the subscribe button and I hope that you have an amazing day.